what you're seeing. The reason that I call them action boards instead of vision boards comes right back to what you were asking about at the start of the interview, which is, you know, why people might be skeptical about manifestation at all, and certainly about a scientist speaking about it. It's because I feel that prior to me using that different terminology, there was definitely a sense that you can create these images or create a fantasy in your mind and do nothing but sit at home and wait for it to come true. And it's all going to come to me. Yeah. And I don't believe that at all. Um, I would go as far as to say that if you create a vision board and you don't do anything to try to make it come true through your own hard work, it will never come true. Mm. It might even create a negative reinforcement because you feel like, well, this is all bullshit. But mm. you have to take the visioning and combine it with the action mm -hmm. and actually take a step forward which takes courage sometimes, yeah. which is why we were trying to prime the brain because the brain is exactly. reminding you yeah. like, hey, you've done this in the past or somebody else has done this in the past. Mm -hmm. And yes, you're stretching or yes, you have to take a little bit of a leap, but it's possible because you're seeing that imagery every single day. There's two things. So there's that. You're absolutely...